What's really interesting about a blog book tour is it's very much a part of the times. Publishers do not have the money to send you out on the road, you know, like a 16 city media tour or anything like that. So if you want to get the word out about your book and truthfully authors, you're going to have to do all the work yourself. Setting up a blog tour is actually really an efficient way to get the word out about your book without literally having to leave home. You do it all from home. So a couple of months before your book comes out, you want to reach out to like-minded bloggers, even to bloggers that are sort of on the periphery of what you're writing about, and see if they'll host a guest post from you, or a guest video, or maybe they want to do a Skype interview with you, or you've recorded a podcast, or even if you've created a book trailer, they may just put put the book trailer up as sort of that guest post, and then you're getting the word out about your book. You have one post a day. When I've done blog tours, you know, let's say April 1st to April 30th, every day of the month I'm on a different blog doing a different post, a different podcast, a different video, all the while reinforcing this is my new book, this is what it's about, here's my message that's relevant to the audience of this blog. And the cool thing is, that lives out there forever. So even when the book tour is over, I can still see through Google Analytics links coming back to me, people coming back to my Suddenly Frugal blog from those guest interviews that I did years ago. Thank you for listening. Please review our other available content for help writing, publishing, and marketing your book. If you have any questions about the Author Learning Center, please contact us by email at authorsupport at authorlearningcenter.com.